guys, so I thought I would take you through how I go about actually mixing the acrylic paints to be able to do a fluid art piece. Um, firstly, obviously I start off with just eyeballing however much paint I think I'm going to need. I always add my Floetrol first and the reason that I do that is Floetrol is a paint conditioner. You buy them in Australia at Bunnings. Um, I think this is four liters and this four liters would literally cost about 55 maybe 60 around about there so mix that first because it makes the paint smoother and easier to mix with the water so when you're mixing the water start off with very little at a time Sinus, will you check for me? I'm in the actual frame. So very little at the time. Thanks. And mix, 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 mix. So what you're looking for, so this is way too thick, because you're looking for something that's approximately the equivalent of melted ice cream. So that's what you're aiming for. So add water and really every single thing that you do here is about mixing because while you don't want to do it too vigorously because you don't want to get air bubbles in it you do want to make sure that there's no lumps so almost there I'd make this just a little bit thinner and as you could see there was a lump in there so a little bit more mixing You do also use the um, heat gun, so again bought at Bunnings, just the attachment and you actually buy the gas canister separately. And um, that also helps you get rid of the bubbles in the paint. Okay, so I'm not going to do the whole video mixing all of these because I think that would be really boring. So just to give you a good idea, that's the consistency that you're looking for. So the next video that I will be doing is the actual using of this paint. So if you're interested in seeing that in the colours, feel free to watch the next video. Thanks for your time.